the, the, the safety and comfort of your own food. <laughs> Sorry, that's great. I love this classic dish. Be your last Master Chef 20 minutes. What are you making, Sophie? It's going to be a roast loin of venison with smoked black pudding spatsley. What's, what's spatsley? Spatsley is like a little sort of noodly dumpling. I love the sound of Sophie's venison with the salsa verde and those cannellini beans. Five minutes, just two minutes. That's it. Stop. 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 We've invited somebody to come in and taste with us. Ed, could you bring your plate up, please? Stop. Potatoes are cooked great. Everything's cooked well. But it is overwhelmingly quite sweet. Sophie has cooked a fillet of venison, smoked black pudding spätzle, with roasted beetroot, a beetroot and horseradish puree, and a red wine sauce. I really like this dish. It's a yes from me. The venison's cooked really well. I adore that Japanese. I think it's great. Stunning presentation. I'm not sure I agree with Greg about the presentation. It's quite intimidating. And that's all I've got. Well, if you think a lack of muscle shells is the only yeah, problem with no, that presentation. Agree, I know. <laughs> that's one of the most ill-judged dishes I've eaten in a long, long time. As soon as I got into apple and out came all that sharp, sweet juice, I thought, what on earth is that doing in there? It almost made me t recoil from it. It's not very good, I'm sorry to say. You look disappointed. We only had one good dish, and that was the venison dish from Sophie. Sophie's dish, the venison cooked beautifully. <laughs> Sorry, that's great.